What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to do something that's been bugging me for so long and that's how much does Big Bertha weigh after my 7 inch lift kit, uh, my 22 by 12s and 35s which is the most recent update to the truck. I really want to know how much it weighs. I tell people 5,000, I tell people 6,000, I tell people 10,000 pounds. But how much does it really weigh? Let's find out. Two hours later. So to weigh a truck, we actually have to bring it to a local truck stop and we're gonna use the cat scale system. Um, and let's go ahead and get her weighed. So we're pulling it into the scales. We gotta line up to the yellow line on the floor, which is right below here. I'm officially on the scales. Let's find out. So, what did she finally weigh? Let so fast forward a couple hours, I went home, and I almost forgot that to finish the video, I need to talk about what she actually weighed. So, just some context on the truck. When I weighed it earlier today, uh, the truck only had uh, about half a tank of fuel, and each gallon of gas weighs about 8.39 pounds. Just for rounding sake and for math's sake, we're gonna say eight pounds give or take 12 and a half gallons or what are missing it's about 96 pounds we're going to round that up to 100 pounds just for easy math i was also not inside the truck when the truck was weighed and the truck weighed in at hopefully it'll focus 5500 pounds now give or take the fuel that's missing another 100 pounds that makes it 5600 pounds on a full tank and then including me which is about 170 pounds you're talking about 5770, almost a 6,000 pound truck. Um, why is she on the heavy side of things? That is because it is running on 22 by 12s, uh, 35 inch tires, and a seven inch rough country lift kit. All those additional components, this is a knuckle lift. Um, so the components are all very, very heavy and they add to the vehicle's overall weight. So when you're doing these kind of setups on the truck, you're actually adding more stress to the motor, more stress on the transmission, uh, more stress on differentials on these vehicles. You wanna go ahead and find ways to alleviate that, either a re-gear, um, adding a little bit more horsepower to the motor, just to alleviate um, the extra pounds you're putting on the truck uh, for the looks. My truck is pretty much all cosmetic, but it's definitely added some weight to it. So that's what she weighs, 55 on half a tank, 56, let's say full tank of gas, um, 57.70 with me and a full tank of gas inside of it. Realistically speaking, half the time she's not running on a full tank, but just to know what it is, full to the bone, that's what it is, 57.70 guys. Don't forget to like, subscribe to the channel, hit the little notifi uh, notification icon to help when I add new videos. My next video is gonna be a walkthrough of what's actually done to Big Bertha and kind of give you guys some insight as to all different modifications that have been done in this truck since I bought it. Uh, thanks for checking in, guys. Peace.